What is up guys? Welcome back to Shannon Bradford Outdoors. Today we're going to go over some of the mods that I put on my Clam, Nanook, XT Thermal, uh, two-man ice fishing sled. So let's get right to it. All right, this is what she looks like from the outside. All closed up. And then this right side, I'll have it opened up for you all. I'll just do a little walk around the outside here does have a back door which is nice there's all that the first mods that I put on it um, I put a running kit on it so you can see all these screws in the bottom of the sled it's got some there as well as the other side uh, just to preserve and save the bottom from all the wear and tear and then I had a problem while I was fishing um, the burbot bash up in Wyoming it's a two-day two-night tournament but I had, I had to figure out a way to anchor this down to the ice. So this is the back side here. I uh, bolted on some D-rings one on that side. One on this side as well. And that just allows me to attach a strap there or some rope and anchor it down into the ice from the, the back side here. To anchor down the front side, we'll walk through here. I got some of these uh, rapid straps. So it's just a little Velcro strap that connects onto the pole and then I can anchor down boom on that side from the inside of the tent and on this side as well. So anchor them both down. That keeps the front side from shaking in the wind. But yeah, that's super steady. The most recent mods I just put on here are the two fish or the pole holders rod holders um, they are put in kind of weird the only other option was to put it um, was to put it down on the side of the sled like this but the Nanook style tent is like a shallow shallow sled so that would be you know dragging in the uh, dragging in the snow so I just flipped it upside down used it like that I'll show you what it looks like from the chair here Yeah, just put a rod in there. Works good. And I can rotate this. I'm kind of ro rotate it back and forth like that. So yeah, those work good. I wanted them put in the middle of me. That way I could just get up and walk out the door. A lot of people put them on this side of them, but that's getting in my way from getting outside. So I didn't do that. All right, I had some audio issues on this, so I'm just going to voice over. But the next mod I put on here was the Clam Corner Console. Um, super easy, nice to put on. Um, somewhere to put my Mountain Dew, you know, some extra gear, lures, and some pliers. And then I also put in the Clam 4-rod four um, four holder. And then I have, of course, I got the, the uh, coat hangers there. I've got four of them, so that's going to be... Super handy for camping. And then I do have a second chair that goes here, but I also put my uh, cot right there. So I'll show you what the cot looks like right now. This bumps up right against the front there. And then got some room still to hang some rods if I need to, but yeah, I'll just sit here on the seat. And I'll fish with the hole right here. And then the heater is way over here. This thing is super long. I don't have to worry about it burning my line or anything. But yeah, I got a hole here, heater, and all my junk in the back of the sled here. But yeah, super nice tent. I really enjoyed it. Um, I usually just haul it out with me. Um, I have a snow. I don't have. I don't have a snowmobile or snow dog or anything. But I just drag it with the rope. I need to get a, one of those harnesses. I think that'd be a lot nicer than the rope. But yeah, there's my there's my tent. Alrighty guys, that's gonna be it for this video. If you have any questions about any, any of the mods or anything about the tent, comment down below. Hit that subscribe button as well while you're at it, and we'll see you on the next one.